I've been dreaming so much lately About your face when you're smiling It's the only thing that saves me mm -mm. Hey, I don't know if I told you That I think you're beautiful And how I can't wait to hold you Yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling down And I don't know what I would do without you Yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling down Hey, now look into my eyes You can use them as a mirror, baby You're my ticket to paradise Hey, now everything's alright We've been longing for each other The cheese crater behind me, the cheese crater, the shard, the walkie talkie, and we have the London Eye behind me. It's unfortunate that we can't go to the London Eye right now, but uh, I did a video of the London Eye last time when I was here during summer. So, if you guys want to check out the London Eye experience, I'll put a card up here so you can go and check that out. Right now, we cannot go, everything is closed so. It's unfortunate, I really wanted to try it again, but next time. That's the River Thames, guys, and I'm told that a lot of people have thrown themselves, so they put a number here. It's saying, talk to us, we listen, whatever you're going through, you don't have to face it alone, and they have that number. So if you feel like committing suicide, you feel sad, you can talk to them and they'll help you. Freezing outside a little bit high on the feeling can't see to focus in the corner of my best friend's sofa you were getting by some rum and cola wasn't brave enough yet just to talk to you not a smooth talker under pressure sweaty palms ain't making it much better something about you so special Pretty other from the minute that I met ya What you are seeing in front of you is called a cutty sack. So what is a cutty sack? A cutty sack is one of the last tea clippers to be built. Cutty sack was the fastest of its time. It was one of the last tea clippers to be built, coming just before the advent of the steamship. So I did mention something to do with clipper. So what is a tea clipper? Clipper is used to refer to a fast sailing ship with three masts and a square rig. The word comes from the clip, meaning to move swiftly or at a fast pace. Yeah. Katisak was launched on the 22nd November 1869. Were you even born? Wow. The week it was launched was also the week that the Suez Canal opened. This meant that tea clippers which undertook long journeys to China were suddenly bypassed by steamships which could go through the canal. This is the view that you get when you're standing in front of the Katisak, the River Thames. A couple hours from Japan, would you stay awake? I'm losing touch of who I am when you're far away. And I feel like I'm running in circles around you.
hot chocolate to keep me warm because it is three degrees now next to the river thames london and i life is good <laughs> even if it's cold life is good but the hot chocolate helps to keep you warm the only problem is that you feel like peeing a thousand times because when it's cold you want to go to the toilet and then plus the drinks well it's life I am now very close to the London Eye. You can see it just above my head and I can get a proper shot of it. So I just want to show you guys what we have around here and some close-up photos of the River Thames, the London Eye, the Houses of Parliament and also the Big Ben Clock Tower. I hope you enjoy! so much lately about your face when you're smiling it's the only thing that saves me mm -mm. hey i don't know if i told you that i think you're beautiful and how oh, i can't wait to hold Big ben you Tower. yeah you pull me up when i'm falling down and i don't know what I would do without you, yeah, you pull me up when I'm falling down Hey, now look into my eyes You can use them as a mirror, baby You're my ticket to paradise I fed the birds and now they don't want to go. Oh my god, I wish I never started this because I don't have any more food to give to them. Poor birdies. I have already showed you the most important things that I wanted you guys to see today, which is the London Eye, the River Thames, the Katisak, Houses of Parliament, Big Ben Clock Tower. But I have a, another video of the whole of London sightseeing. So I will put that video on top here so that if you are interested to see other parts of London that you did not see in this video, please click the link and go and check it out. So now I just want to show you guys around. Just have a look around at what we have here. There's a park right opposite the London Eye. So I'm just going to cross over, go and check the statues, the beautiful gardens and show you. And then we finish the vlog. Let us start right here where I am standing. So who is this guys? This is a booty car. This is the real meaning of fight like a girl in the game of thrones. Wow, this woman is a fighter. When the Roman Empire took her lands and harmed her daughters, the fearless queen Boudica was not about to let them go away with it. The warrior led a historic uprising against the Romans in 60 AD, causing catastrophic damage to multiple towns and even burning London to the ground. Can you imagine? Burning London to the ground. However, her reign of fury didn't last long. By 61 AD, the Iron Age's ultimate fighter met a perilous end, so she was defeated. Look at the cart of uh, the cart that she's riding. It has pangas on the side, so that if you get close to her, you get slashed. What a beautiful woman! What a warrior! I told you guys about history. It's fun, right? Look at this. The Battle of Britain and somebody has put some flowers on the ground to remember somebody maybe. So this is Charles G. Gordon, Major General Engineers killed at Khartoum. I think that's Khartoum even if there's a V. I was lost or I was found
guys i'm gonna end this video right here because it's gotten dark and i'm going home now i hope you enjoyed the little video of london and i'll catch up with you in my next video stay tuned remember i post a video every single week every friday bye